Hello, my name is Judy, and today I'm not reading a story. Today I'm talking about what happens when I open up my Mozilla Firefox browser. And recently I have been coming up with some recommended news stories for me to read. And some of them are blogs, some of them are just things that are in the news. and some of them are pretty interesting but i decided to dig around a little bit and see why am i getting recommendations for these particular news stories or topics and so i clicked on how it works actually it says recommended by pocket and you can see how these recommendations work and so apparently pocket is uh, recommending news items for people who have firefox and it is on the new tab page apparently which is why i'm noticing it recently and you know at first i just did i didn't pay any attention to it because we always get recommendations don't we but then I started reading about it and I found out that Pocket is a part of the Mozilla family. And it uses, like so many other intuitive software items that have come out recently, it uses your past searches to uh, recommend things that it thinks you might be interested in. Apparently, Pocket uses past searches that I've done to figure out what kind of things I would be interested in reading or looking at. And I've got to tell you, it's pretty accurate. There's also a new feature that they plan to implement where you can make personal recommendations, but they're still being tested. So it's not a feature that you see right now, but I think it's gonna be getting pretty close. I think the more information the computer, uh, not just the computer, but different software programs can collect, the closer we're getting to computers being interfaced with our brains. So I don't know, maybe I'm being paranoid. What do you think? All right, well, that's my little rant for today. Not even really a rant. If you knew me, you'd know I don't rant very much. I do rant at my kids over, you know, not picking up dirty clothes, but I think that's pretty much just a mom thing. But anyway, what do you think about Pocket? What do you think about Pocket, pocket recommendations? And what do you think about the possibility of our brains actually being connected physically to our computers? Uh, please let me know in the comments below. I am eager to read comments on this. Okay, well, that wasn't a story, but, you know, until next time.